Contact and Human Dynamics from Monocular Video. Given a monocular video of a single person performing a dynamic activity, our goal is to estimate a physically plausible 3D motion. Existing methods produce accurate 3D shape and pose that result in small local joint errors. These motions look reasonable from the input camera viewpoint. However, the side view reveals visually and physically implausible artifacts. For example, noisy jitters and unnatural leaning. We also observe feet floating above or penetrating the floor and moving when they should be in static contact. These errors limit the usefulness of recovered motion for tasks like animation and scene understanding. In this work, we look to improve an initial 3D motion estimate using physics-based trajectory optimization. Optimization constraints are a natural way to express physical reasoning. However, jointly optimizing discrete foot contacts with continuous full-body dynamics is challenging and prone to local minima. To manage these challenges, we introduce a new strategy to extract physically valid full-body motion. We use a learned model to detect foot contacts from video that uses automatically labeled synthetic data for training. These contacts initialize a trajectory optimization which uses a reduced dimensional body model and simplified dynamics to handle complex motion. We focus on videos of single people performing dynamic walking, dancing, or sporting motions. As input, our method takes initial 2D and 3D pose estimates from existing methods. In the first stage, a neural network detects foot contacts based on the 2D lower body joints. We train this network on a new synthetic dataset that includes RGB videos, 2D and 3D pose, and foot contacts that are automatically labeled with 3D heuristics. Next, we use the inferred foot contacts in a two-part optimization to refine the initial 3D pose estimate from monocular total capture, or MTC. The kinematic optimization estimates the ground plane and ensures the input motion respects the predicted foot contacts. Finally, the physics-based optimization finds a dynamically valid center of mass trajectory and foot contact forces. The objective of this optimization is to closely match the input motion and foot contact times. Physical reasoning is applied through constraints. For example, motion must follow rigid body mechanics, feet are static and on the floor when in contact, and contact forces push away from the ground with reasonable magnitude. Overall, this results in a new, physically plausible full-body motion. Please see the paper for more details. We first show results from the Contact Estimation Neural Network. Our model makes smooth and accurate contact predictions after training on synthetic data. It is also more accurate and stable than a naive 2D velocity heuristic. Next, we show qualitative results of 3D character animation from real-world videos. The output of our method is shown on the right. We compare our final result to the input from monocular total capture, along with the motion after only kinematic optimization. Looking at the torso and center of mass trajectory, we see smooth and natural motion after adding physics. From the side view, optimization fixes feet penetration from the input. In this example, the kinematic optimization fixes feet floating artifacts. The physics optimization moves the feet to avoid unnatural leaning.
Our physics-based optimization solves for center of mass motion along with foot positions and contact forces. Optimized center of mass and forces are shown here. Our method generalizes to characters of varying mass and distribution. The mass difference is reflected in the optimal contact forces shown here. The success of our method is largely limited by the quality of the input motion. A noisy initial pose input can drastically affect the floor fit and final output motion. Next we show additional results on real and synthetic videos. Thank you for watching.